Kristen with AAA State of Play, and today I will be interviewing Kevin Van Wy about playground maintenance. Kevin, you are CPSI certified. Could you explain a little about what that means? Well, CPSI means Certified Playground Safety Inspector, and basically it means I've taken a lot of rigorous training and testing to make sure I'm aware of all the uh, playground safety standards set by the Consumer Protection Safety Council and the ASTM. How long have you been CPSI certified? Since 2011. I've just recently completed my second certification process. Your uh, certification certification is uh, good for three years. In that time, have you used your certification in any capacity to address playground maintenance issues? Yeah, definitely. Uh, clients have hired us to come out and look at their playgrounds to make sure that uh, they can pass safety standards that they're up to code per se, uh, or to have us tell them what the problems are with their playground so they can get those things fixed. Additionally, I use, use it every day in our job here at NVB uh, to make sure the equipment that we sell meets these standards and working with our customers to make sure the equipment they're buying will fit properly in their playground setting. Do you think it's a common misconception that many buyers think once a playground has been purchased and installed that the process is finished? Without a doubt. You know, most people when they buy playground, the majority we find, don't even think about safety surfacing, even from the very beginning. And safety surfacing is something that needs to be maintained all, across, you know, all along the life of the playground. And it's probably the most important part of having a safe playground environment. So in your opinion, how does a park or school benefit from a playground maintenance plan? Anybody with a public playground, parks, schools, churches, apartment complexes, they all can benefit by uh, having a documented routine maintenance plan of, you know, one, their playground equipment is going to last a lot longer. It's going to be usable and they're going to get more money out of their investment. You know, secondly, this documented maintenance routine plan will help them catch problems before they happen. And finally, in case an accident does occur, this, this maintenance plan and a documentation involved with it goes a long way to helping you with insurance coverage and claims, or in case there's a lawsuit, showing that you've maintained the playground in a safe environment and it was truly just an accident. Well, thanks for taking the time to discuss playground maintenance with us. Before we go, is there anything else we should know? When you're dealing with playgrounds, and especially commercial playgrounds, deal with a professional. Make sure the people you're dealing with have some CPSIs on their staff, that they had experience in commercial playgrounds. There's a lot of people out there who kind of do playgrounds as a sideline and maybe more residential, and you want to deal with professionals who really know their end of the business. Well, thanks again, Kevin. No problem.